This is the weather in uh, Dana Point. I'm not even sure if I should uh, hoop net today. Look at this weather. I already brought my stuff out here. <laughs> but look at the weather. I'm like a honey badger. I don't care. You think this weather is going to stop me? Nope. No guts, no new subscribers, right? First legal of the night. Alright, let's see if this guy got anything. Is it bouncing? Is it bouncing? Is it bouncing? Just smallies. Just smallies. And that's how I hoop. I bring it up. I don't see anything I like. I just toss it back down. Alright, here we go. Do I feel bouncing? I do. I do feel bouncing. I do feel bouncing. And I feel heavy. Anything I like? Is there anything I like? Is there anything I like? How about you? How about you, buddy? Are you uh, 18 and over? Almost. Oh. I think you're not. What about you? What about you? I don't think you feel legal. Are you 18 or over? Nope. You ain't. you are 
do feel like a legal. No, I only feel like a legal. I'm not sure about you. Oh man, you are barely legal. Yeah, yeah. You are legal. There's a legal in here. Maybe there's two legals. I don't know. Let's see. Do we have any legals? Anybody over 18? And this one? Oh, I feel it bouncing. It's quite heavy too. Okay. Yeah, looks like we got a legal. Maybe we got, we got two legals. Oh wow. That is a really big one. Yeah, that is a really big one. Definitely legal. How about this one? Let's see if this one's legal. Wait a minute. We might have a keeper. Two keepers. We might have two keepers. Oh, that's a really big one over there. That's a really big one over there. That's a big one. Alright, let's see. Are you a keeper? I don't know. Are you? Oh wow. Nope. You are under 18. But you we're definitely over 18. Oh wow, this is, oh my god. This is probably the biggest lobster I caught this season. Wow. Come on man, let go. Let go dude. Wow, this one is really strong. Okay, good. This is the biggest one this season. For me. This one is really strong. Wow, it's really strong. Freaking strong. It won't come out. It won't come out. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. He's out. He's out. Okay. Finally. Look how big this guy is. Wow. Okay. All right, so I just pulled up this net. It was so heavy. Um, but check this out. 
Look at all these lobsters. I mean, how many is there? Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, yeah. Ten lobsters, one pool. But, of course, most are short. All right, gonna call it a night. Oh boy, it's kind of dark, isn't it? Is that better? <laughs> uh, yeah, so uh, used bait does work. Okay, I was able to catch, I don't know, at least 30 lobsters tonight. But most of them were short. I was able to score four legals and so far using recycled bait or old bait tonight that I had used uh, in the last uh, trip out I was able to catch my biggest lobster this season okay so let me uh, pack everything back up uh, into my truck and then I'll do an outro uh, once I get home. So the topic of this video is does old bait catch lobsters? Does old bait catch lobsters? And the answer is, well, you're looking at the answer. Okay. Let me just um, bring out a legal size lobster a, of course I mean an average size lobster versus this one okay where did it all go so I'm still currently at Dana Point at Baby Beach So this is a regular size lobster, legal size. This is a giant size. Okay. Um, not the biggest one I've ever caught, but legal size, average legal size, giant lobster all right so what we're going to do is we're going to chop up the uh, scallions it's already washed about two inches next step we're going to make the sauce Sugar. About two tablespoons. Sugar. Okay. Next, pepper. grounded pepper about two tablespoons or one and a half depends on how much spicy you want it cornstarch about two tablespoons depends on how thick you want it mm, yeah, you know what let's just use it all so that right there is probably about two to three tablespoons. Oyster sauce. About two tablespoons. A 
one and a half, two, depends, but that's about good. Sesame oil. About one and a half tablespoon. Okay. White wine or white cooking wine. Okay. We don't spike our food with alcohol beverages. Okay. We don't, we don't, we don't do that to our dates. So this is going to be about one, one and a half tablespoon. Okay. Chicken broth, one can. Stir it up. If it gets too thick, you can add in some water later. Now, I use avocado, uh, avocado oil. Uh, about two to three teaspoons. Okay. Okay, so about two to three minutes. I fry for about two to three minutes. All right, now I add in the sauce. Okay. If you see it too thick, Add in a little bit of uh, more water.
we're gonna add in the scallions. Okay. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and add in the scallions. Mix it up. So, once again, this is what it looks like. Okay? stir fried lobster my favorite way to eat lobster time to try it out I'm cooking the, uh, the head on the other uh, pot but time to try this out wow the meat just falls right off look at this Meat comes right off the shell. All right, time for the test. Mm. Wow. Really good. Meat is chewy. Meat is very chewy. Let me see if I can uh, bring the uh... so the meat very chewy. Hmm. Hmm. So the taste of the pepper, the sweetness of the sugar, the saltiness of the oyster sauce. Um, I mean, you guys got to try this, and if you guys make this for your date first date doesn't matter what date your girlfriend your date your lover and you cook this you feed it to them they will do anything you ask them to do that night That night, after you feed your lover, your date, this, you'll be hitting more home runs than Babe Ruth. I guarantee it, 100%. If you don't, you can come back to my channel, cuss me out, leave a thumbs down, but I'm telling you, this is your ticket, okay? Very good, try it out before you feed anyone though try it out and it's and you saw i'm i'm gonna put in the recipe probably you know as i put the stuff in but uh um, blown away blown away all right well guys thanks for watching i'm gonna finish my food and uh finish cooking the uh, the head of the lobster so we'll see you next time thanks for watching